हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो यू आर वाचिंग राव गेमिंग चैनल सो गाइस लास्ट एपिसोड में हम लोग न्यू टाइटल क्रिएट करते हैं द मिस को चैलेंज करते हैं और मैच भी जीत जाते हैं मैच जीतने के बाद हमारे पास दो टाइटल रहते हैं उसके बाद कर्ट एंगल आकर बोलता है कि हम लोग कोई एक टाइटल चूज कर सकते और हम लोग इंटर कॉन्टिनेंटल टाइटल चूज करते हैं सो so गाइज आगे का स्टोरी कंटिन्यू करेंगे और देखते हैं ये स्टोरी मोड क्या किधर जाता है लेट्स कंटिन्यू दिस वीडियो Hey champ, just want to let you know we're wrestling tonight. And it's for the title. Uh yeah, Kurt actually texted me about it this morning. My dad texted you? He never responds to my texts cuz he says he's not really a texter. Huh. That's odd. Anyway, want a picture together? Uh sure, I guess. Is this something you normally do with your opponents? Not really. I just thought it would be a nice memento for you to have after you lose your title tonight. That's a keeper. I'll text you the pick. Uh, thanks. Actually, no. On second thought, I'm not really a texter. We've been waiting a long time for this one. The championship is up for grabs right here. Next, it's Jason Jordan against an imposing adversary. A championship match. What we've all been waiting for. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and is for the inter. Singles action is underway and in this one I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. inflicting some serious pain here. As we say in the trade guys, the monitor area in the locker room is likely sold out for this one as there are plenty of superstars with a vested interest in the outcome of this match. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. He's got the shoulders down. To Byron's point, there are several competitors on the roster who can make a case for being the next in line for a title opportunity. However, a lot of that, of course, depends on the outcome of this match here tonight. And with that in mind, regardless of their personal feelings, you'd have to think the locker room is rooting for the champion here tonight. The last thing they want to do is have to wait even longer while the champ's rematch clause kicks in. The champ to the top turnbuckle. I think this man means business. Jason Jordan getting pushed to the limits here. If you ask me, fellas, this championship match is among the most highly anticipated that we've seen in quite some time. Jason Jordan just too fast for him. Oh, he's able to reverse it. Oh, and he reverses it. What does Buzz have in store? We're about to find out. He's gonna do it. Like you, Corey, I've had this championship match on my radar for quite some time, and so far, I think it's safe to say that it hasn't disappointed. No, it definitely hasn't, Michael. Which is saying something, considering fans' expectations heading into tonight. I can tell you that they saw this as a potential match of the year candidate, and so far, I think it's delivered. What does Buzz have in store? Move after the other. It's devastating. Now that's how you successfully defend your title. Oh. 
Seems to be going for the cover. What a way to win a singles match. Now let's take a look back at some of the great action. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great... You think Jason Jordan still wants to take a selfie with Buzz now? Real classy, Byron. What the heck? Do you hear the buzz? It's the sound of the cicada emerging after years of slumber from their underground existence. Just as you have emerged from the underground and made your presence known. Unfortunately for the cicada, when it tunnels its way to the Earth's surface, it only has mere weeks to live before it is eaten by a predator. Well, I am that predator. For I am the eater of worlds. You should have stayed underground, my friend. Because now I am coming for you. <laughs> this has the potential to be a very bad situation for Barnes. <laughs> Hey, not to be weird or anything, but I've been meaning to ask you since you got to Raw. What's up with you driving this retro van everywhere? Uh, it's just what I'm used to, I guess. I kind of lived in it when I was on the indie scene. Kind of? Okay, I, I definitely lived in it when times were tight. And then when I signed with WWE, I decided to uh, fix it up. Keep it running. Interesting. And the Bug logo? Oh, this used to be my dad's work van for his exterminator business. It's pretty much the last thing he gave me. I guess his way of supporting my crazy wrestling dreams. That's cool. I mean, other than the fact that it still kind of smells like pesticide. Well, I think your dad would be really proud of what you've accomplished so far. Yeah. Yeah, me too. We have a great match coming up next. We have a real fan favorite versus a formidable opponent. Oh, I cannot wait. Get ready to feel the buzz. Face the facts, man. As Puzz is set to take on Kurt Hawkins in this non-title match, we have to discuss what happened last week when Bray Wyatt appeared and essentially threatened Buzz. That was creepy. I don't have a good feeling about what might happen next. When the Eater of Worlds sets his sights on you, nothing good can come from it. You have to wonder if the specter of Bray Wyatt looming over Buzz will be a distraction from him going forward. Normally, I'd say it would be a concern, but luckily he's facing Kurt Hawkins, who's on a bit of a losing streak, to say the least. The damage has been done. Six. What does Buzz have? He just plants his face. That almost came out of nowhere. He goes for the cover. And he kicks out. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. to look at his eye here, folks.
Got him with the power bomb. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. Well, he's got to get himself out of it now. Clearly on a mission here. He's stumbling some now. This match is definitely testing his metal, guys. Now back to the ring. He's too quick for him there. Oh man, Kurt Hawkins is in trouble. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. What's he gonna do with it? What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's gonna do it! He hits it. Buzz brings everyone to their feet. I'm not sure how much he has left. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Short arm chop, a piercing strike. What does Buzz have in driven? Face first. This one's over, guys. He's going for the pin. Yes! Unreal performance. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary... Do you Not again! again. It's the sound of insects buzzing all around us. But unlike you, they serve a purpose. My fireflies light up the night so maggots can seek out and dine on rotten flesh and waste. But you, you're simply a parasite, feeding off of everyone you encounter and giving nothing in return. Your lineage itself was built on someone whose sole purpose was to leave death in their path to exterminate. And I find that amusing because that is exactly what I'm going to do to you. You see, at TLC, you can leave your precious title at home. I'm not concerned with that trivial ornament. What I am concerned with is your demise, your extermination. I'm not going to stand here and let you try to play mind games with me. But what I will do is accept your challenge for a match at TLC. What is happening? <laughs> I have no idea, but this is a sick man we're dealing with. <laughs> Luckily, we're not the ones dealing with him. He's Buzz's problem now at TLC. Sorry to interrupt, um, whatever it is you're doing. What does it look like? I'm rosining my violin bow as one does. Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, listen, I've got a match coming up against Bray Wyatt, and I was just kind of hoping you might be able to give me some advice. Brother Buzz, are you woken? Um, I don't think so. 
If one is not woken, then there is no hope in combating a force such as the monster you speak of. And even I, who is supremely woken, have lost many battles to him in the Great War. Okay, so how do I become woken? That is like asking how your vessel breathes the air. It must materialize on its own. Or there is the technique of a jaunt to the multiverse, but all this rosining about and dispensing of wisdom has given me much weary. I must retreat to my quarters. Good evening, come here. Okay, thanks. I guess. Well, I'm not sure that was very helpful for Buzz. Coming up next up. Oh, up. it's Bray Wyatt. Here we go, backstage brawl, guys. And guys, nobody walks away from a backstage brawl better than when they went in. That's including the winner. A ring simply cannot contain them. Here we go. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. out. He's going to do it. Through the table. Will Buzz be able to continue? I doubt it. They're on the move again. Where are they going now? The action is officially on the move. Is he really gonna do this? This is bad. Oh no. No, this is sick. Sister Abigail! Come on now! Please don't do this! Oh my god! What kind of twisted individual would destroy something that meant so much to Buzz? Bray Wyatt would. The man operates under a different set of rules. Uh, I can't believe this. There you see Buzz arriving for his match tonight at TLC versus Bray Wyatt. Yeah, I noticed he wasn't driving his van because Bray Wyatt torched it. And that wasn't just any van. It was a gift from his late father. You have to imagine he'll be seeking revenge on Bray Wyatt tonight. I know you were cleared by the doctor. But I need to personally make sure you're both physically and mentally fit to compete tonight after what Bray Wyatt did to you last week. Hey, you probably don't want to talk about it right now, but I'm sorry about what Bray did to your van. I know it meant a lot to you. Thanks. I appreciate you saying that. Wait, 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 wait. Were you gonna hug me because that's your thing, or because you're worried about what might happen tonight? Um, more the second one. <laughs> I'll be fine. The only person anyone should be worried about is Bray Wyatt.
Hey. Where's Bray taking him? Somebody needs to stop this!
तो so ये वीडियो खत्म हो गया है हम लोग सक्सेसफुली एक न्यू राइवल स्टार्ट कर दिए ब्रेव वाइट के साथ होगा बट इसमें मुझे सबसे सही लगा वो है ट्रिपल एच का जोम्बी मोड अगर आपको अच्छा लगा हो जोम्बी मोड तो आप कमेंट में येस और नो डाल सकते हो सो so गाइज मिलते हैं नेक्स्ट वीडियो में थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो अगर वीडियो अच्छा लगा तो लाइक करो चैनल पे न्यू हो तो सब्सक्राइब करो मिलते हैं अगली वीडियो में तब तक के लिए बाय बाय टेक केयर